Hey guys, Sword here, and this is Operation Bedrock number 20. We reached our 20th episode, and if you haven't guessed it by now, I'm going to be uploading Operation Bedrock every Saturday. And hopefully I'll be able to actually work on the other projects I have in mind, but it seems like Operation Bedrock is taking most of the time and the attention and focus onto it. Of course, there's other games I still need to play that I promised I'd actually be playing, but that's another story. And as you can see, that I'm taking the suggestion of one person that he wanted to see me actually mine so figured oh god lava figured why not just make the tunnel or at least scouting this is what I call scouting but first that I wanted to actually show you guys that we have already reached a thousand diamonds that's why I have a diamond pickaxe in my hand and now what I'm doing is what I consider scouting and scouting is basically you build the what's it called the borders of the tunnel because this is basically three torch path and I'm basically mining within three torch path trying to make the sides for the tunnel so that when my friends or other people join they'll go to the tunnel and then they'll just start mining through knowing that there's no lava in the way as well as that there is nothing to worry about and hopefully that by then we'll find more diamonds and then I can just get some more diamonds and make diamond pickaxes and give the diamond pickaxes to them I am losing my train of thought I'm jumping all over the place now. So, again, this is kind of a really neat method for me to actually try to get the tunnel done so that we'll know how far we are from the edge of the world and as well as that no one or no one will actually mine outside of the tunnel because we're just focusing on this tunnel and we're focusing on Three Torch Path so we could actually have the boundaries around the entire world and then maybe, just maybe, we'll actually have a minecart going through the entire world so I could actually show you guys how long it takes to go around the entire world on a minecart versus walking. Because walking, it, it takes you almost 10 minutes to get from the skylight all the way to the point we're at right now and everybody is complaining, everybody wants to see some minecarts but you gotta understand that if we don't have anything planned out it's just gonna be like we put all this here and it doesn't look right or something's off take it all out start over so this is why I did not want to do any minecarts or any stairs for that protect particular reason well especially stairs because we're just gonna destroy that anyways and stairs they take forever to destroy have you ever destroyed a flight of stairs because something messed up you know how I'm gonna feel or you already know the feeling of trying to destroy some staircases like that but I digress oh god lava there's always lava this is why scouting helps scouting helps to find lava and as well as to get rid of lava along the way so that once your friends or other people join in and they start mining and they probably passed over like 20 different spots that there used to be lava. It's like, why there's no lava here? It's like, I scouted, I got rid of all the lava. So basically, this is like almost the first time I really ever played by myself to actually do something. I'm not lazy. Well, ten, yeah, I am lazy, but it's like, it's better to play Minecraft with a group of friends than it is to play by yourself at some time unless you're actually building something that you don't want anyone to see or anyone to actually mess with that's when it's understandable and I'm actually backtracking to see how far I am for the lava spot on the other side that we already skipped over so this is how it is gonna be so this is kind of a this is actually a really neat method to actually try if you want to try out making a tunnel try scouting so you'll know that you'll how far you are from your destination and how as well as that if you find lava you can actually easily get rid of it and since I didn't have any gravel in my hand this is particularly the reason why I'm using stone I'm pretty sure that this is on the one layer area and if I find lava under it then I'll just stone it up again so apologies that I didn't have any gravel in my inventory and I didn't I really did not want to go back I was contemplating actually going back but I figured now nah, I'm just gonna exchange continue on if I need to make a chest I'll make a chest so we are getting closer and closer to 10,000 iron hooray and what are we gonna use with all that iron we're gonna probably make some rails or something that that you need iron for so this is why you actually set up a guideline or at least what's it called a goal to have in mind because when we reach the thousand diamond I wanted to show everybody that we there's actually a thousand diamond in the world that you could get legitly without any duplication and also I can I honestly don't believe that there's over 16,000 diamond as one video will say but I'm just not gonna dispute it 
it's that who knows there maybe will be more diamond because i know for a fact that diamond spawn whatever they want to spawn because i've actually visited back one of the other tunnels that i've left a long long time ago and came back to it and what do you know diamonds so that kind of put a foot in my mouth and just basically yeah there could be a possibility that there's going to be a lot more diamond because they just spawn out of nowhere at times so we're going to continue on with the tunnel and oh my god there's some more lava that to get rid of well, while I'm at this, there's gonna there's an update to the, how many people that wanted to help me out, and I still apologize. I'm still procrastinating, and I'm sorry. One of the reasons is that when I invited like three other people that I never even knew, we tried to get down to the tunnels. They were either lagging or they just weren't listening, because it got frustrating to the point where I just couldn't handle it anymore, and just basically rage quit from Operation Bedrock for the day and I just did everything else. I wanted to get some work done but I just kind of I just rage quit from Operation Bedrock because I keep telling them go this way, go this way, go this way but they just wouldn't listen either that they were lagging or they just absolutely wouldn't listen. So if I'm gonna actually invite people I want them to listen because I just don't want them to mess anything up especially when they actually bring along a guest. And I'm not talking about one with an actual Xbox Live name. I'm actually talking about a regular guest, like split screen. Because a lot of people tend to forget that if you invite a guest and whatever he has in his or her, his or her inventory and they, they stop playing, like they get out of the game, everything they have in the inventory is gone. And I've already had two instances where that happened, where the guest decides to stop playing and just leaves and then... Everything that they had in their inventory is gone, and you have no idea what resources they have, what they picked up, and it's just really, really bothersome. So I really don't, I honestly want to stray away or avoid having to invite a guest, unless that, that your guest absolutely knows what this, what is going on, and they will know to put everything in the chest before they leave. So yeah. And I can't wait for 1.8.2. Everybody wants me to talk about about 1.8.2. I'm hoping that 1.8.2 will come in within this two weeks. This is my prediction because apparently some people wanted to know my my thoughts and my predictions on 1.8.2. So here it is. It may be here in two weeks, give or take. Maybe add another week to that because who knows how long cert testing will take and then they'll pretty much certify it, officially announce it, and then we wait for the release date. And from there, hopefully I don't I have a day off or something that I could actually make videos. And if not, then I'll probably take the next probably three days to actually film because I always get a busy, busy schedule. I'm usually working the night shifts and sometimes I get one or two days off. I rarely ever get three days off. So let's see how that goes. But let's continue on. I kind of sidetracked from what I wanted to say earlier. Here is, an, I believe, an update from where we last left off of the helpers. And again, I still gotta invite the helpers from the beginning of the list before I get to you. Although some people actually are persistent, they are still standing by me for everything I say, and they stand by me like they they just wait patiently until this happens. But again, I have five, four or five other projects that we could all work on that isn't really Operation Bedrock, but it still has that great magnitude. So, let's continue. We got Godzilla Gojira, IWG Ballin, Queasy Sundu 25, I'll be OGC, Amaze Me, Jade Cubs, Captain X Crunch 4, I'm Yoshi XD, Fanuke 44, Gavatine 774853, A Monopoly Game, Rage's Fury 74, LOL What? Or LOL's what? TF Bear, Kill Me, Kill You, Zombie Slayer, You Mad Bro, and Battled Sign 40. Please don't spam me again. I already had two pages of spam. Please just don't spam me. I just want to say that. Elite X Soldier 87, Clashed Bullets, D U V, or is that a Y? Yeah, I think that's a Y. I can't tell. Freaking Microsoft. Underlining with a red, can't even read anymore. D U Y D Y L. Born to Kill 494. Epic Killer 9191. Loose Caboose. Zombie Killer 1314. Samuel Samuel 628. I X Loggies. Q Gug Trigo. Is that massacre? This this massacre man. You spelled massacre wrong. 
All right, going down the list, going down the list. Plus Rare, Scooby-8 Online, Metal Skulls 5, Twisted Phoenix, Mini Logo 22, Ghost 447, Dottius Pluto 3, Destino, Echo Shift 90, or 78, sorry, I Fades QSM, I'm That Dude 98, Twain Commander, Cyclone Claw X, Big Boy XXX123, OLK X Showtime, and Trey123, I Will Eat You, Halo Superman, GI Mini Camper, Lightning S, Blue Rascal C, Red Boy Kool Aid. So that's all the names I got for the update. I just didn't want to read from the beginning again. So I believe if I counted right, I didn't even count at all. I'm just assuming that's it's over 30 names. So people are still watching it. I thank you for still watching it. I'm still. I thank you for actually want to know how far we've gone so far. Even though just times times change. Like people lose interest in Minecraft. Like they lose a what's it called motivation to play Minecraft they lose their focus on it so they kinda stop playing I've already pretty much someone lost five friends like they were from they were helping me from the beginning and now they just stopped playing Minecraft pretty much all together so it's kinda sad but once the update comes by hopefully they'll help me out again but who knows so until then I also announced that I'm actually helping helping out a lot of other people by showing them their worlds and I have a list for that too so if you hear your name on the list I have you down we got blazing dude 123 get away I can't see this why okay joker 5931 Dottius Pluto 3 D to the G 1994 mini little 834 V Furo Metallica Bruins OD Blackheart J Cubs Gamer Adam 10202 Rob Dakilla 365 X dot X e X Eagles X Bacon Rocks Triple Zero H X C Wingman K Meg Three Sorry K Meg Three Fifteen X Ace X Millennium Death King Ninety One One Thirty Four Mercy X Triggs X Merc X Assassin X X Sir Mutley X X so I have your guys' name down after I'm done helping out comic with his world because that is a big world and I have a lot more to commentate on I believe I only have like three videos for the point of this video so let's see how that will go and then I'll start filming everyone else's world and don't expect me to actually upload it the next day because I have other videos upload and as well as that it takes time to commentate and I'm gonna have to write down everything that I have heard and remember from their worlds and then put that in the commentary itself because I completely forget a lot of things and I'm sorry for that but again, I also tell you that you can just visit their channels if you have any questions about their world. And again, I don't, I'm not judging how great or how amazing One World is, even though I actually say this is a beautiful, beautiful world. But keep in mind, this is your world. This is your project. You should be proud of what you have and don't think anything else of it. Is that if anyone brings you, if everyone says that your world or project is dumb, that's their opinion. It's yours. It's yours to have and yours that your creation, you should be proud of it. Don't care what anyone says about it. Haters are going to hate. And as you can see, this is basically the edge of the world where you saw that I couldn't mine anymore. So I'm going to actually go down this way because this is where I had to go. And basically just continue mining till this is the edge of that world. And then I'll scout, scout or reverse scout back to the beginning. So... This is basically three torch path. This is where it's going to end, and then we're going to take another ride. If you go down the tunnels, you always take a ride. That's my advice to give to you. So, you're going to have to recount it. So, there's one, no, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen by three. Of course, I'm on the set first floor, so right now, this is basically just mine everything out. And I recounted because of my OCD, of course. So, again, I have a lot of videos to film and a lot of people's world to show. Be patient while I got, get through this. And hopefully, let's see how people like everything all together. So, I'm going to continue back. I want to see how far I can get before it's too late. So I didn't want to end the video it's so early. I always like to go to the 15-minute mark. Uh, that's, just, that's just my thing. Oh, look, Redstone. So... Hopefully, you enjoy this video. Come back whenever you feel like it. You can put the 
put some stuff away or something like that. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm looking at anymore. So have a nice day, everybody. I am Sorokin09, and as always, I will see you in the next video.